Today very well might be the most emotional day yet, but in a good way because this little guy is turning one this week. And we are going today to get his very first haircut. <laughs> What do you think about him going to get his first haircut? <laughs> John, you want to tell everyone Wait, where we're done. going to get his haircut? Yes. Okay, so Wait, we're going to the same place that I got out? my very first haircut <laughs> and where I got my last haircut. At the same place, Earl Brigham's Barbershop. So. <laughs> We what a kid, man. Okay, <laughs> look at this. How cute. This is going to be Red's face today, if you can see it. He that is, is like, <laughs> yeah, not loving it. <laughs> look, how, look at your mom and you with your little bottle. John's mother Whoa, this and is Earl's wife, like, were best friends forever <laughs> since they were, like, yeah, little kids. pretty much forever since Look they were young. Look at this. They were I'm friends old. forever. Look at these pictures. <laughs> yeah, you, are. you shouldn't open this. Book. John no, I can't put it grew down. up next door to like this family. They had a bunch of kids, also all of their kids are friends with them. They're all best friends. And the cool thing is that Earl is actually deaf, and he signs um, to communicate. So all of the boys, all of the Webster children, can actually sign. Uh. Correction. They can sign. Not very good. Which is but pretty Earl cool. Earl makes it easy. He's easy to talk so, like, to. So like they all can Whether communicate. You know or don't know. And they can do sign good. language. And so anyway, it's kind of I thought thought that was a pretty cool story. And he like has had this business like cutting hair like his whole life. That's what he does to support his family. And everyone who doesn't know sign language, they I guess they type it out on their phone or something. Yeah, and they, or they show write it, it to him or they'll but write he can it out. Also read lips he reads well, web lips very well. Which is how your sister Adelie is. She can read but lips. But it's so well. cool. Like I just think that's so cool that like he still like has a job and like functions like totally fine and does like such a cool like it's just so cool because his barbershop is like this really old school, like he doesn't take appointments. Everybody just comes and sits and chats and hangs out. Yeah, he so, loves to talk to people. It's so fun. So anyway, we're gonna take Rhett for his very first haircut and see how he does. John also is in desperate need of a haircut. Yes. Because it's getting a little, it's Maybe getting a little it long up there. Yeah. <laughs> so well, he's gonna. Anytime it starts touching my ears, I'm like, oh, okay, it's time. Yeah, so we're actually both. They're both going to get a haircut. At the same time, my one so, boy. That way, Rat hopefully buddy. won't be frightened. Me and Buddy. Me and Buddy. What'd you think? <laughs>
kids pretty much have had it, so we are taking a little stroll outside. He came back to the car, got the stroller with the buddy, and we are just gonna take a little walk because it's a little hard waiting in a confined space, so we're just gonna take the kids out and explore the city while Daddy gets his hair cut, so. Fun times! <laughs> You gotta give me this. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna fix my hair. You're gonna get a haircut? Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. Oh! <laughs> Macy's been begging to cut her hair since she got here because she thinks she also is getting a turn, so he is doing a pretend haircut on her so that she also gets her haircut. <laughs> I love haircuts. You love haircuts? Yeah. You're so cute. Oh. Look at you. <gasps> wow. <laughs> You're beautiful. Do you love it? Yeah. <laughs> Say good job. Give him a kiss, kiss on the cheek. Oh. <laughs> Let's see it. Oh, beautiful. Just beautiful. Here's a place. Lexi's walking right. I'm my Patsy. I have taken a photo of this little man every single month. And this is his very last monthly photo. And it's sad. Are you sad about it? No, you don't care, do you? <gasps> Say, phew, got those out of the way. Ready for the next. Anyway, so sad because he's literally, this is it. This is his very last like baby photo in the months. He's now gonna be one. And I can't be like, oh, he's like 11 months, like he's still a baby. I have to actually admit that he's like gonna be a toddler. It's kind of sad. But anyway, he's ready to move on to the next stage, aren't you? Yeah. You're gonna be out there before you know it, playing ball with daddy, having a grand old time. All right, for this special occasion, I'm gonna let you guys tag along as I take his very last yeah. monthly photo. I just take him on my phone and I have like an app that I edit him with. But it's always tricky trying to get him to look and smile. It's, there's a few months that I did not get that to happen. Mm. But, you ready? Mm. Oh, don't cry now. Are you ready to change? Is that ready to change? Yeah? Okay, let's go take his last photos. There we go. There's a big old boy. Are you ready? Are you ready? Sit down. Put your arm in. Don't curl in your feet. There you go. Yeah, don't curl. I'm sad to see him grow up. Oh, I know. You're teething. You're cutting teeth and you're just chewing on everything. Ow. That was the eyeball. Oh. I saw that mine. 
Can you say bye bye? Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>